Your ass got robbed for that phone. The last time we saw you in Africa, you got robbed that very night. You didn't have a phone to go live, so you had to go live from your mama house about a week or something later, because mama always pay for your tickets. Get my baby out of there. <laughs> Hell yeah, mama pay for your tickets and them uh, uh, your angels. Send donation, I can get an airplane ticket. See, playing games, you didn't even get the benefit of Africa. What you came home with, some jewelry? Man, if you don't get your stupid ass out of here, most of us ain't going to Africa for no jewelry. Oh, I'm going to go get a bracelet. If you don't get the away from me, oh, I'm going to get some rocks off the ground. These are, these are special rocks. Man, if you don't get your... Moses had this rock. Jesus used to carry this rock. Uh, Abraham, he had this type of stone, and that's what gave him the power. Stupid ass, idol worshiping, dumb ass. And ain't nothing you could dig out the ground that gonna give you more power than what God could give. Because God can make you successful. You don't look successful. What God are you praying to? What Allah are you praying to? The invisible one or the one in flesh? Now that right there, I could shut his ass down. Which God you praying to? Allah, which Allah? The invisible God, the spirit, or the one that's the son of man that visited us here in America? two different two different situations that guy he don't like us to fight with each other so i don't fight with you in public because that's the god i pray to yeah, all that gossiping and spreading business and talking like if somebody trusts you with their business why would you tell the public some business that somebody trusted you with that proves your character oh yeah he did this he did uh, is that my business or your business? Well, I'm going to just tell the business. Go ahead. Watch what God do to you. N did I tell y'all a going to come home and end up back at a job? Did I tell y'all this six, seven, eight months ago? Nine months? I said, this n lost his mind. He really having this type of talk? He's talking like about me, the man that helped him? You didn't even get your passes to come to Africa to my wife. And you hate her so much. You jealous because you don't have a wife. You don't have no girlfriend, nigga. You don't have none of that shit. And that's your business. But a man with a family, I take care of my kids, my mom, nigga. I pay for everything. My family don't, my wife don't work no job. Why are you on here lying? Because that's for clout. You know goddamn well, my wife don't work no jobs. I, would, I wish if, if you catch my wife at a job, somebody come shoot me in my face. I wish I would let Tisha Boo ever have to work. She can bless me with five kids. I'll rob you before I let her go do that. Sorry about that. That's still my politics. Before I let my wife be at a job, and nigga, I'm out here getting racks. I wish one of y'all blow my head off, nigga. JT, your wife got a job? She work a job? Hell nah, nigga, who said that? Oh, the b that b said it. Oh, I know. But I just want to come come on here and blast them and show them some more racks, nigga. Some bank deposits, a different world, nigga, when you can show the results of what you do. It's one thing. Look at my skin and my face. Where do you see a drug addict at? You so jealous, you think you got something to say. All you doing is making shit up now. I'm not no addict, nigga. Do I look like an addict? <laughs> See, your jealousy got you fed up. You should have kept your mouth shut. Maybe you would be able to have a job for real now. Maybe you could have been part of the Traflix team. You always screamed it. You was my number one rider. But really, you was trying to get something from me that you couldn't get. So then that's when you realize JT going back to America. I need to stay in Africa and make JT look bad and make me look good in Africa. Instead, you just robbed them You robbed all them stupid yah yah.